All right, kitty. It's time to fix this videotape. This is from a client. It says holiday July and August 1991 first tape. It looks like there's some water damage, some dirt. And if I look at the inside, what? What? What do we see here? Yes, kitty, there's something very peculiar about this. So, here's the symptom. I played it back, and up to this point, nothing on the tape. No signal. And it sounds a little crinkly as I go through. Then I get to this point, and it freezes. The tape stops playing. The video starts appearing. Okay, so what happened here? The tape is twisted, obviously, so when it played from the start, to this point, it was playing the back of the tape. The back of the tape was going around the tape heads. So the magnetic stuff was on the other side. So what I'm gonna have to do somehow is flip this over. Now, I'm gonna guess it's, it's probably flipped over somewhere else at the other end. Uh, either that or like somebody has messed with this. So we're gonna find out what we can do about this, because this is family video, it's probably the only existing copy of this, from 1991. Let's do what we can to save this. This is a tape made in West Germany. That's all this tape is, that there was a West Germany still existing. It's a JVC tape with a JVC label. There's two things I could try here. One, I could try manually winding this and looking for the end of it that's twisted on the other end of it, because I don't want to rewind it in my tape decks. We can't just twist them with a pencil like we used to with cassette tapes, you remember that? But there is this little button here. There's a brake mechanism inside this shell. When I press that, the brakes unlock and I can turn the wheels. So I could rewind it manually. It's not a, it's not a really long bit of tape, but that would take a while and my hands would get really tired. Uh, the other option is take the darn thing out of the shell and see if I can unwind it that way a bit faster. Let's try that. If you've been watching my other videos, you've seen me get into some hairy situations with videotapes. I'm trying to feel as I'm taking these screws out, have these screws been taken out before? Am I the first one in here? Because the client said, hey, can you do tapes that have had the ribbon out? Uh, maybe. I will at least do my best not to be destructive. So far I have a record of ruining no tapes and salvaging most of whatever tapes have been given. But I've never seen one like this! Oh shoot, I always forget to slice the outside of that. Kitty, go get me a utility knife. There's never enough of those around. Oh, oh. Yes, okay, the other thing to do is not let all the screws fall out. This is already popping out, I don't like that. I don't like that. I don't like that it's popping apart. Because I hate trying to put these things back together. Don't you get too close, kitty, I've got a knife. Okay, so I need to slice along, ah, the label. All right. The important thing now is I have to grab this thing like a delicious sandwich with yummy bacon that's gonna fall out. I grab it, sandwich style, right? Ah, oh, okay. Now it's the right way up. If I do it the other way, boom! Stuff's gonna pop out. Springs and gears and all that stuff and it's way harder to put back together. This, not so bad. Okay, I'm gonna take this out. And it's twisted. It's just, it's like, I've never ever seen this before. Okay, so you probably know that videotape is a few parts. It is, was it, okay, did, oh, I'm gonna have to go back and check the replay on that. Was that twisted twice? Because if that was twisted twice, then I'm good to go right now, right? Oh, I didn't take note of the tape path again. If that was twisted twice, no, it's not. Because I, look, it's now still unraveled wrong. I'm just going to ignore some of the things I've probably done incorrectly. And we're gonna wind this thing through. Just so I can rewind. I'm not claiming this is the absolute correct path. 
just put it on this girl. As a single on the screen with that version. All right? Like that. Okay. Okay, so this is gonna take a wee bit. Okay, the edges of this one are looking a little rippled. Oh my god, it's all wrinkly here. And there's bits of oxide coming off the tape. Okay, so tape we were saying. Yes, I went off topic. Tape is is parts. There's the plastic piece in the middle. So it's the ribbon. It would be clear if you could see it on its own. It's just a long piece of thin plastic. Then there's glue that attaches the magnetic particles to the tape. And it's a whole, it's like really tiny rust particles. You can imagine it like that. And if you imagine from science class, um, think back to science class when you played with magnets you can line up the polarity of magnets and if you can manipulate the polarity of lots of little teeny tiny magnets you can record a signal and that's how these work and if they are abused the uh, rust bits can separate from the plastic tape and once that's gone due to age damage whatever, you're right and truly out of luck because you can't get that back at all. You might get a snowy picture from what's left on the tape, but when that part of the signal's gone, it's gone. That's why I hope to like get every frame of this that I can. No questions asked about, well, I might ask. I might ask. Do you guys know the history of how your home movies came to be in such a weird condition? Ugh. I'm gonna guess the story involves somebody at the cottage, or somebody moved, or a moose. How much more is there? Oh, oh, there's a wrinkly part here. There we go. There's the culprit. Okay. The people who love their gear are going to say, Hey. Oh my gosh, this is the super wrinkly part. What the heck? Why are you letting you... Why are you playing these sus videotapes in your good machines? Because I care. Wow, okay, so it, it wrinkled at the start. Just past the leader. Yeah, so this is messed up. I'm gonna take off the glasses for this part. Because yes, I'm that old. Okay. Tape goes across here. Let's make sure it's not wrinkled. There. We're gonna thread it through, yeah, and then rotate this hub so that it will fit. Tuck it past the brakes. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, 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 okay. As we tighten it up, I can show there's an equally wrinkled part of the start. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna wind past that so that that part of the tape never meets my video heads. And you're like, but dude, isn't the client's stuff on there? Like a fraction of a second. These tapes move not super fast, but they're going past the heads pretty fast. And if there is anything there, it will be very brief. Okay, uh, what I would love to do if I weren't afraid it was gonna, you know what, I'm gonna do it anyway. Forget it. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna reassemble this, I'm gonna put it in the machine, I'm going to go fast. 
go, go ahead, put it in the comments, tell me off. I'm gonna put it in the machine, go fast forward, because I can see here there's different, like a few different b bands of material here. I don't want the tracking to go all cattywampus. I'd like to get a good winding of the tape, so I'm gonna go fast forward all the way to the end, zip, fast, uh, rewind all the way to the beginning, zip, then probably manually take it out advance a little bit and then see if we can get a good capture and then I will be able to say hey I got your video done sandwich right zoom flip and I'm gonna start with the middlest screw first time to pop it in the VCR here we go ready to rock What do I see? I see... <laughs> Look at that! <laughs> Something! Woo! That's a big win for the client right there. Okay, so I'm gonna rewind this. Okay, so we've got our video, black levels down here. Maximum white will be up here. There's some wavy lines in the video because it was so wrinkly. That ribbon is going past the tape heads and they're scanning it in a helical pattern. And it's coming up uh, with some wavy lines here and there, but those might smooth out a little bit uh, when I get to the deinterlacing stage. Um, we've got sound levels. This is good. This is great. Uh, we'll call this a win so far. Once we get to that super wrinkly part, it's the picture will fall apart for a second or two, but all things considered, this tape went from unplayable to uh, you know family memories preserve forever. Yay! Uh, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more like it, you can subscribe. I'll, I'll try to keep making more of these. Uh, and uh, blah, 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 blah. Blah.